The summit to empower entrepreneurs and business leaders with effective strategies to scale up trade on the African continent has been held. The African Goose Summit seeks to, among others, uh, alleviate poverty through enterprise. <laughs> The summit, themed Winning Strategies for Leveraging the African Free Trade Agreement to Scale Up, is an annual event seeking to promote trade among countries on the continent. It also involves effective collaboration among sector players to harness the natural resources of the land, while African leaders should remain committed to opening their borders for trade. Discussions at the technical session focused on the African Continental Free Trade Agreement and how entrepreneurs could position themselves to take advantage. A multilateral and regional trade officer at the Ministry of Trade and Industry, Mexen Opoku explained, unity is key in achieving a common purpose. Convener of the African Goose Summit, Karen Evans Helm, emphasized the need for intra-African trade. Africans trade a lot more with other countries that are not on the continent than they trade within the continent. So the whole idea of this is to open up the discussion for um, business leaders and businesses on the continent to understand what um, the, the provisions of the um, agreement is and how we can trade with ourselves first before we begin to look outside. 28 out of 54 countries have ratified the AFCTA protocol with more hoping to ratify at the African Union Conference in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia this weekend. Karen Evans-Helm was confident membership would receive the necessary endorsements. As the first 28 countries who have ratified this thing start enjoying the benefits, the others who are observing will also jump on board and then little by little begin to conquer. Eventually, Africa will not become one big market overnight. That if we, if we are expecting that, it would be a big fallacy. But I think that once we are able to do this gradually and we don't give up, eventually it will come to pass.